Hey everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guide. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, and we assist clients from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones and tablets and other mobile devices. Now, one of the services that we're most frequently asked to perform by our clients is the SIM unlocking of a device in order to be used with a different carrier or network other than the one that originally sold it. By default, most devices are going to come with some sort of lock that restricts them to the original carrier, and they have to undergo some sort of lock process in order to be used with a different carrier. Now, with that in mind, what we're working here with today is an LG Aristo, originally from T-Mobile. We'll jump into the, the settings and show you the model information here in just a second, but I wanted to show you this screen first before I dismiss it. This is the message that appears when you insert a SIM card that is not originally from T-Mobile. And so the phone does not ask for an unlock code like some devices use. It simply tells you that you have to go through the device unlock app in order to get its SIM unlock for another carrier. T-Mobile started using that process probably back in oh maybe 2014 or 2015 where they actually removed the unlock code process and instead initiated their own uh, unlock app uh, feature in the phone so they control everything on the back end i'll jump into the hardware settings here to show you that we are working with an lg m210 so if you look that up, that is the model number for the T-Mobile LG Aristo. And we're making this video to let any interested clients know that our business does offer service to be able to get the phone SIM unlocked for use with other carriers without having to go through T-Mobile and go through that whole uh, unlock app process. We have our SIM card from Cricut here inserted into the device, and Cricut is a prepaid carrier here in the U.S. that runs on T-Mobile's, or I'm sorry, AT&T's network. And so once we have the phone unlocked here, we should be able to see that it runs perfectly fine on that network. That's actually something that I'm running here right now on my computer with our program. So once the phone finishes up here and then reboots, we should be able to see that it works just fine with our Cricut SIM card. The program's just finishing up here. It shouldn't take more than another few seconds here to run through. Okay, there we go. And now the phone will need to go through and restart, and then we should be able to see after that that it pulls back up and is unlocked. So give it just a second to finish up here. Okay, so there goes the restart. So we've got the LG logo here showing up, and we'll just give it a minute to run through and do its thing. And there we've got the T-Mobile logo. Okay, so if I swipe away the lock screen here, we actually see that we don't get that message about it being network locked anymore with the invalid SIM card inserted, so that's a good, uh, a good sign. Let me see if it's registered with Signal yet. Yep, sure enough. So let me jump into the network status here in the settings and we will show you what we got. So there we go. So the device is now showing registered on Cricut with our LTE service there. We've got the signal bars there up top and of course that uh, network lock message has been uh, removed. So the device has now been fully SIM unlocked and it is usable on other GSM networks. Now specifically in the US, AT&T is the only other carrier that uses GSM technology. So as far as the US goes, AT&T carriers are the only other ones here in the US that this type of device would be able to be used with. Now, like I mentioned, Cricut uses AT&T's network, so that's why our SIM card works in there. Internationally, though, most other networks in other countries use the same technology, so if you're looking to use the device in a different country, it should work perfectly fine there. So if you have a T-Mobile LG Aristo and would like to get its SIM unlocked for use on other carriers, go ahead and contact us because we would love to help you out with that. All of our contact information will be right down in the video description, and I'll also put a slide at the end of the video here that has all the info there as well. While you're here, make sure to check out all the other videos that we have on our channel as we offer a lot of different services for a lot of different devices, and I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy down the road. Make sure to hit that subscribe button also while you're there to be notified of all the new videos and services that we're constantly putting up, just like this one. Y para todos los hispanos hablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks for watching everyone and have a great day.